there's some very good non-surgical treatments for carpal tunnel syndrome, and those begin really with modifying activities that provoke the symptoms. And that could be as simple as um, avoiding prolonged positions of wrist flexion or wrist extension. Um, a lot of times people will complain that their hand goes to, uh, goes to sleep as soon as they raise it to talk on the telephone or read a newspaper. So trying to avoid those activities is the first line of treatment, um, and that can be um, supplemented with a wrist brace that actually maintains the wrist in a relatively neutral position. That can be worn during activities such as driving for a prolonged time or um, if there is some other activity at work that seems to provoke the patient's symptoms, that can be tried. Uh, nighttime wrist bracing is actually quite effective for relieving some nighttime symptoms. Beyond that, uh, the next step would be considering a uh, steroid injection into the carpal tunnel. We're not quite sure how it works, um, but people generally get significant relief um, from a steroid injection into the carpal tunnel, and uh, sometimes it can be relief that allows them to avoid surgery uh, permanently, or it can at least provide them some temporary relief.